La 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 la. There we go. Thank you. The microphone is working again. Right. What's happening? We will be playing a different game tomorrow. It's just I've only got like an hour today. And we need to try and keep the consistency. Feed him human meat. Get him better. Okay, that pig moss, where are you going? What are you doing? Okay, taking a simple meal to inventory, that's okay. But apart from that, you can go you can go back to bed. Are you going back to bed? You are going back to bed. Fantastic. Who's getting heat stroke? Is it hot outside? Oh it's a heat wave. Okay. Temperature. Temperature. Yes, temperature. Get these. And boy moss, you are the, the builder, so build these real quick. Before everyone else goes mental from uh, from overheating. A gold ore meteorite. Fuck yeah. Are these cold boxes doing anything? Not really. Boy must go do that one real quick. Then this one, then this one. Get those built, please, sir. Hopefully this should help pull people down a bit. Do you have any parkers on? You do have a parker on. Boy Moss, real quick, go and strip this man. Because we want his parker before he bleeds on it. Before he bleeds. Oh, he died. Doesn't matter then, you can just get the body whenever. Oh, okay, he was quite far away. That is understandable, gold ore. Nice, that's pretty big meat, right? We are low on food. You guys leave in a couple of days, right? 1.6 days, that's fine then. We are real low on food. Animals. Keep the squirrel. Two. Go three. Big. Yes. Who is? Is anyone on a handler? Girl moss. That's so brutal. We need to swap this into corn. It's like faster growing actually um, potatoes. Because now we've got all these animals, they keep eating my crops. So we're not building up the, uh, the amount we built up before.
let's also, whilst we're like this, let's get rid of all the babies. We don't have the food for them right now. One couple of each. There we go. All murdered. It's a lot of murdered animals. We've got heckin' heaps of meat now. Oh, we should finish the floor though, boy moss, before you're cooking. As well. Still hot outside, no. Yes, Boimos is finally putting the floors down. Good. Good, good, good. This is going to look so much better, Boimos. All your hard work is going to pay off. hospital for me so I can see where it is. Good. Good, good, good. Boy Moss, real quick, finish that. I don't know why you didn't previously. There's a fly landing on my nose. Annoying. We do need to get to electricity so we can make a fridge. There's a lot of my meat is rotting away. Annoying. We do have people researching, just no one is researching. Okay, they're leaving. Okay, bye. Probably didn't need to kill all those animals. Well, I did because they were eating all my crops anyway. No, not medical. Prisoner. Quest complete. Nice. Refugees are leaving. Sick. Back to just girl moss, boy moss, and pig moss. And two of them are in hospital. Many success. But we do have absolutely loads of blocks now, so it'll be quite easy for me to start replacing walls and such. To try and limit the amount we are on fire. Or can be on fire, should I say. Or the deconstruct. start with this wall in here and get all this replaced we can use one of the other ones we could probably use oh sandstone yeah we'll use 
limestone or sandstone. Or use limestone. Oh, we use granite. We've got enough granite. We can use limestone and sandstone for other things. Such as floors. I really need you guys to stop being fucking dying, if I'm honest. Nice, that's good though. Getting that door done. Making our things work again. Right, let's add in the walls again. Build the wall again, where, where are you? Where are you? Oh, you are there. All oh, my meat just right away. Wow. That is not ideal. Girl Moss is fully healed. Big, big success. Big success, honestly. Is there anything else set to haul? Because we don't need to haul it now. Because we we don't have the people hauling it for us anymore. Okay, here we go. Are you sleeping as if this is your bed? I think you are. As in, like, sorry, the bedroom. Oh, okay, because the other bed is there, I see. I see where the issue is coming from. Come on, pig moss, you can do it. Wake up. Okay, better, 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 better. Deconstruct this. This, 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 this. Nice. get them built. You're going such a weird way to do this, boy moss. Oh. 
drinking the goat's milk. How uh, how's your health doing? Seventy percent. That's not too bad. Right finger, right thumb. We'll probably replace your hand, because aren't you the one that wants your hands replaced? Yeah, let's... We'll let you get a bit better, and then we're going to replace your hand with a wooden hand. Because your uh, manipulation is already down. And this way... You will be happier as well. Oh wow, you had a bad night's sleep because you didn't fix this one part here. Funny. Next we're gonna deconstruct this one. You should be able to get this amount of walling done in a day. I don't know what delayed him yesterday. That's what keeps delaying him. He keeps moving on to the um, the drugs, the building of the drugs in between me uh, telling him what to do. Because he's so rapido. Finally. Okay, you're fully healed. <coughs> perfect, perfect. Scoosh. Scoosh, scoosh. Goosh. There we go, get all these done. And then that's all the walls done. Next it will be replacing the um the the furniture. Instead of wood furniture, we'll replace with stone or steel. Just to really minimize how much of our shit can set on fire. Start with the uh, end tables. I think we make them out of what do we have a lot of limestone? Slowly, we will replace everything. A mad tortoise. Where is this mad tortoise? Where is this mad tortoise? Oh, there he is. He is just taking his time, his sweet time, because he is a slow little boy. dead to us. Fantastic. Yummy. Tortoise meat. Blocks we can probably stop. We've got enough blocks right now so if there's other things you can be doing. Take moss. Do those instead. Uh, 
we need to replace that because that is wooden. We've got this, these two left to do. What are you doing? Why is this here? All that. I don't know why this is here. Move. Look at that. That in there. Put that in there. And then. Next, get rid of all the seats. Place all of those. Although, in fairness, these seats probably are going to be flammable because I'm going to do the uh, the comfy furnitures. something with the ambrosia? What does ambrosia look into? What does ambrosia cook into? Where is that ambrosia? Or is Ambrosia a drug by itself? Safe dose is once every 1.6 days, we're just not going to. Okay, so all the seats are done. So we should be able to replace with the cloth seats, right? One, two, three. Here we go. Get ourselves some lazy boys for the workstations. that stand this this way what's that Just roses all the way around the inside. In fact, you and me. Fuck it. Fuck it. I'm gonna do it this way. We're re, re expanding it again. I know. And they'll be all roses, so it'll look pretty on the inside here. All these bullshit animals waking up and eating all my plants. Ding dongs.
I don't think we've got enough to finish all the seats. We do not. That's fine, we've got most of the seats in. Okay, let's um, let's deconstruct these next, please, boy moss. And then let's rebuild. Not steel. Can I make it out of stone? I can't. Okay, so it will be steel then. Fully steel workbenches is what we're doing. Fire prevention at its best. Make sure you don't have any wood furniture. Uh, so also deconstruct this, deconstruct this, and deconstruct that. Okay, and that means we need furniture and to a table out of sandstone can go here. Production, we can have a butcher's table. Where is the butcher's table? Okay, it has to be steel. Butcher's table out of steel. Uh, miss, got ideology. Sliding room table. Also out of steel. Okay. And then eventually we'll do this one and change that to steel as well. And then we should be pretty good. It'll only mainly be the beds that are flammable at that point. Let's also make a what do we have above? We've got a lot of limestone. in here as well that improves their, their their quality of life okay and you got rid of the research table let's do a limestone research table and then we're looking good we're looking real good those um those travelers that came along and helped us make the world of stone blocks fantastic let's shrink this down We only really need a small area of storing blocks now. We might need to move some of this around because it looks terrible. But first let's rebuild everything. Higmas has got nothing to do. Same for girl moss. Okay, you're doing the research table first. Good, that's what we need. Hey, what's happening, Fractal? How's it going, man? What is good? I had Nicholas in here with me on the weekend. I'm uh, trying to stream every day for at least an hour on this channel. And I'm releasing videos. Wow, look at me turning back into a, into a creator. Next, I'm going to reopen a Discord. And then go back to trying to learn TikTok, even though TikTok makes me want to pull out my own fucking eyeballs. Oh shit, you got murdered, Pigglywig. Poor Pigglywig. We can go here. Masterwork, good stuff. Starvation, who's gonna starve? Pig moss. Okay, boy moss. Go and melee attack the boar to death and then cook the boar because we're hungry. Uh, douche. Um, did I set the bill back up? I did not. Butcher creature, do forever. Include humans. Okay, let's go. Go and kill this. Make some sandwiches out of this pig before we starve to death. And uh, we will also kill these babies as well, real quick. More food. Yeah, I can't stand it either, but it can do really well, man. It's a pretty good funnel to get people to go to your YouTube, which kind of sucks. But, yeah. 
but yeah the the new discord i'll make will be partially normal gaming stuff and then i'll set it up so if you pick the role you'll also get like the crypto and where and nft gaming stuff as well so that people have the opportunity not to what you've been up to um i don't know i can't remember when we last spoke because i know i spoke to nick recently but um i tore my bicep i think i think you were here for that last time we spoke about me tearing my bicep um so yeah i tore my bicep the one of the tendons tore away from the bone so like seven weeks ago i had to have an operation to pin my bicep tendon back to the bone which fucking sucked still sucks actually still sucks what about you where you were working last time right because i was playing seven days to die so oh yeah it would have been a while ago Yeah, it is. That's what I need to do. Yeah, I've, I've started streaming Seven Days Again as well because it's a pretty easy game to be able to split up into content form to send to an editor. Because I'm gonna, I've started paying, I'm gonna start paying a guy to edit some of my videos for me because I want to put out two normal videos, normal game videos a week, and then on Wednesday I'll release a Web3 NFT video, which I can do myself because they're not gonna be long. But the other two could be pretty long videos, like one of the videos that did all right, it got like 800 views. To make that video it took me like five hours, not inclu like including the playtime of, um... wait, did I not add bills onto everything? I did. Okay, why have you got nothing to do? Is there just nothing for you to do? Okay, you can just, you can just make any blocks then. You've got nothing else for you to do right now. Yeah, I was doing either some work for my dad or some... Yeah, it was copywriting. Yeah, it was copywriting you were doing. That's really good that you're getting into that. You can make... You can do pretty well being a copywriter. I honestly think you should try and get yourself copywriting into NFT stuff. Um, because they pay obscenely high compared to traditional stuff. Who we can make Yayo? Um... How much heal root do we have? Ninety six. Maybe we can shrink this down a bit, and then. Then we can make a new zone. And this new zone can be the cycloid plant. There we go. And let's shrink this down a touch. And expand this one to here. And expand this one to here. Very good. Uh, you reckon that's a really interesting niche. I've never considered it. Yeah. Yeah. Like, um, for example, one of my friends just to do uh, five NFT videos on NFT games. She's not got a huge following. Nothing like that. She's getting $650. So, yeah, man. It's, uh, it's a way to do it. I remember telling me about the do you play Lena who made like. Yeah, yeah. He does SEO, SEO and copywriting. So his is a bit more technical than copywriting because he does all like backlinks, parasite links, white hat, black hat, all that shit. Um, I only know this because he always tells me about it and sends me his books and his fucking videos. <laughs> I don't need to know any of this. <laughs> um, but yeah, he makes an absolute fucking killing. But he is very good at his field. Um, did I send you his Twitter last time to follow as well? Because it's pretty good. Um, Ambrosia. We're not going to use that, so we'll just sell that for money. Um, please give me that medicine. Oh, they're jo they're, they can sell me slaves. I won't, why would I want slave children? What am I going to do with a three-year-old slave? Three-year-old slave isn't going to do anything. 
I'll be a useless slave. I'm just going to do the marking. Oh, sick, man. One of the companies I work for is digital marking. You should really not do that, though. You should definitely utilize Twitter as a copywriter. Like, it took me, like, nine to ten months of someone telling me Twitter could be useful before I then used Twitter and realized how easy it is to connect with people that could then give me work. Because a lot of the online, like, the digital, digital work, people connect through Twitter. Uh, the services we offer is um, uh, crafting your digital identity. So, you know, if you were to search your name, um, all these stuff would come up. Basically, what happens is if you've used us, you search your name, a Google panel comes up and the whole front page of Google will be articles um, about yourself. Um, so it improves people's uh, first impressions, online first impressions of you. I think our slogan is like, redefining uh redefining your first impression did i ever tell you how he got clients that copyright dude um i think you did i think it was something bizarre this one there is a mad alpaca coming to fuck us up can you hear it grunting oh there it is Brrr. Yeah, he's just trawling blood everywhere now. Um, depends how the market is doing. Originally, it cost um, 10 grand for a month. But at the moment, because the market isn't doing so great, it's around five grand a month. Traditionally, I only do it for a maximum of three months engaging. Are you still maddened or are you... Okay, you're dead. Perfect. You're not mad anymore because you fucking perished. <laughs> I'm glad to hear you're doing things like this. Because by the sounds of it, it doesn't sound like Nick is. Even though I keep telling him you two are smart computer boys and there's plenty of stuff you could already start doing on the computer, regardless of your age, that can make you monies. What happens after three months? They can, we can talk about potentially doing other things with them. Um, but yeah, normally won't. Only because there's only like, only so much of it you can do before it starts becoming like, uh, not redundant. Um, like you're not moving into anywhere new. After a certain point, like the same media company, in this style can't offer you new people to be bringing in if that makes sense so it's like we as a company you could do it for more than three months but people just won't your clients just won't benefit really from it yeah but you are on a computer a lot already so you're already used to it you don't need to be smart with the computers but if you're used to using like basic things like Word and all that shit. Because you'd be surprised how many people can't even do that. Yeah, and I don't think he's doing anything. Last time. Because he was here on the weekend, I think. Or, yeah, he come, he's come through quite a few times, actually. Um, but when I, when I remake the Discord... You'll get a ping every time I'm live on YouTube and you can all come along and drop a like on my stream and boost my numbers for me. Like good boys. 
Oh, we don't have any wood. Limestone blocks. Okay, so this is what we're doing next. To pr help prevent fires, we're going to do this. We're going to surround ourselves like this in limestone um, flagstone to stop the fires even getting to our buildings. And this should help keep us safer. Yeah, you should. Yeah, that's the problem. Um, I've looked at the different codings to do with games and stuff, but like it can be enjoyable, but the amount of coding you have to do before you actually see something happening is just like soul destroying, man. Actually soul destroying. Yeah. One of my, another guy I know, he makes loads of money and lives in um, Kuala Lumpur. And everything he does is uh, basically automated at this point. And he's, he makes a killing. The only reason I don't do it is it's not something... I don't have enough interest to make myself do it, if that makes any sense. Is this under roof? Because it's not meant to be. We're getting all this lovely flagstone down everywhere. Yeah. People think, like, it's super easy, but they don't realise if they put shit prompts in, they're going to get shit quality stuff out. And a lot of people, I don't know, they seem not to grasp that. That whilst AI is intelligent, it's intelligent, but you need to give it the right instructions. Oh, I don't make much at all, man. I make... But I don't work too much. I easily could make it a decent amount. Like, m mine isn't even considered a decent amount, the amount I make. But that's because I spend a lot of my time not making things instead. Yeah, no, I spent, um, I'll be gone by then because I've got to go meet Zach. Uh, but I stream every morning around this time. Because I can't go to the gym. Have a uh, good rest of your day though, bro. Oh, we need to research electricity. This is going to take us a fucking while. Basic autopsy is prone butchering for organs, often used to ensure her. This research autopsy. Do we want an autopsy? I think we will. Yeah, I think we will, because then we can take organs and then eat the leftover people. How did my goats get out? How did my animals even get out? I'm glad you're getting the animals back, but I don't know how they got out in the first place. slowly everything will be covered now we wait
Nice. Look at that. Oh, it's gonna, it's gonna be there. It's gonna be good. I do need you to remake that door, though, so... Sick, you are remaking the door. Perfect. The most perfect. I need someone to clean this bullshit up. There's fucking filth everywhere, guys. Do we have a pet raccoon? No, there's just a raccoon in here. Okay. I don't want to sterilize them. What? I do, however, want to kill these ones, though. Because the, the animals are really here for aesthetics. They're not, I'm not using them. Sal has given birth. Guess what, Sal, who has given birth? Your kids are going to get killed. Like, almost instantly. There we go. Where is Boy Moss? Oh, he's butchering things, okay. I will let you off, Boy Moss. I will let you off. Murdered. Oh, no, it wasn't murdered. What are you? Lamb. Killed. Job boy moss continuing to make that out there. Once these roses are planted, hopefully these two start cleaning everything up. It is a bit annoying because the pigs keep eating my roses. I think we're also going to reinstall this, just Let's reinstall that there. Can you move this one real quick, please? Because I think we'll put this like this. So they have to come out and be in this area. So they can't take cover behind this thing. What are you? What are you? Lamb. Die. Good morning, Sprout. What's happening, Blue Gamer? I'm good, man. How are you? Um, I'm only playing RimWorld today, again, I was going to play a different game, but I actually have to leave in like 15 minutes to go to an in-person meeting. Gross. Imagine not meeting people on the internet, making me leave my home. Uh, but tomorrow we're going to play a different game. Uh, it's not going to be RimWorld, it's either going to be Zomboid or a another crafter that I got yesterday called, um... It's called, it's called like Stranded or something like that. Is it Stranded? Maybe Sunken? Something like that. The internet is life, yeah. Don't make me go outside. Although, the guy I'm meeting is bringing his dog. And his dog is massive. I think his dog weighs like 75 kilo. Um... Judging on the time, you might be American. Uh, so 75 kilo is what? Like like 170 pounds? So yeah. 
it, it will be enjoyable to get to see this absolute bear of a dog. He has no requirement. Like, its head is about the size of my torso. It's wild. We're currently just making a big path around our wall to stop us setting on fire as much. We have wood, we do have wood, but people just are not filling the things that need wood. So let's let's go ahead and stop this again because you're slacking on your other tasks. And I want you not to slack on your other tasks, pig moss. Boy Moss is really carrying this colony at the moment. Let's just get rid of this and not put any rocks in here. Let's expand this to here. And let's copy. There we go. Although this one, let's storage foods. No food in this one. Food can just go in the other one. So that the food can stay with the kitchen. I wish there was a zoom level I could get just between these two. So we can see the whole base, but we slightly more zoomed in. Yes, Pigmoss is finally cleaning. Like Jesus. Our place is terrible. It looks horrible right now. And then the next, hopefully, he'll go and fill everything that needs wood with wood. Loads of our food just right away. We really need to learn learn electricity so that we can start. Um, what do we need to start doing? Uh, start freezing our food. That's what we need to start doing. This is looking good, though. Wait, is there a roof? No. What's casting this? What's casting this shadow? Transport crash. Can we strip you? We can strip you, goody. Because we want your Parker. And then we're going to let them die, and then we will eat them. We're not going to kill them. We'll let them die of their own accord. Especially as they're now naked, lying... Lying out in the wilderness, nude, nude and alone. How long until you die, bro? Nine hours. Just, just watch him die for nine hours. dead are you are you going to die there we go okay he's about to die perish nice cool you are now food sir congratulations you have been promoted to food boy moss please go and finish that then zone clear home zone
There we go. Looking good. Now this should prevent us from catching fire. Because we got... Wait, is that only two? Is that two or three? Okay, that is three. I wonder if I can do this. Replace the fence in here so they don't have this as cover. And then put you in there. Because I think the pawns will still... Um, still path to it. And then this way, when they come out of here... They don't have anywhere to take cover behind. And then what we'll give for me is a... What do we have the most of now? Sandstone. What we'll give me is... Sandstone Barricade. Put this as roses, and then we will floor. Like that. So then we can stand behind this to shoot people. And then we'll expand you to yeah, keep the roses everywhere. That way, we should always be happy. You... I know you're going to grow slower, but we're going to expand you... Just because it looks better. And then this one here can expand to there. This one here can expand to here. There we go. That looks better now. Get all that stuff planted up. That's been built. So they've got a good place to um, attack from. If anyone does make it in. The pen is still a pen. Good. I like it. Got our roses down as well. <clears throat> so we are looking good. We're looking sweet. Although, where are we going to put power? Very good point. Where will we put the power? Maybe we can wall this off and have some power over here. Out of the back back exit of our base. Um, but yeah, I actually have to go now. I need to start walking to get to my meeting. Um, so I'll catch you guys later. Thanks for coming along. Um, I'll catch you tomorrow blue uh, for a different game. I know you're excited to see something that isn't RimWorld. Till then. Peace.